We are back about the shifting market in the local market. This week, we're going to cover Napa and Venetia. If you're enjoying the content of learning about the real estate market, you want to hit subscribe and the bell notification for future videos. Let's talk about Napa. So Napa consists of about 78,000 people population. Napa, however, is well known for its wineries, the experience of the Napa Valley, the bells and whistles, so to speak. So here's the kind of what's been happening in May of 2022 in Napa. Um, the percentage of properties that have sold above uh, the asking price has gone from like 103 to over 110% above asking price. However, however, there were many properties also that sold below the asking price. Literally, you know, at 90% to 95% below asking asking price. So the shift is real, folks. Ladies and gentlemen, the shift is here. You can feel the shift more in a more cosmopolitan type of city like Napa. There is a wide range. So if you're looking at sold price being at around 90 to 95% of the asking price versus 102 to 110% of the asking price, that's a pretty wide range that didn't really exist before a few months ago. So that's what's happening in Napa. Now, let's Let's talk about Benicia. Benicia is one of those smaller cities located in Solano County. Um, you know, it has the waterfront. It has some really unique features, especially it's downtown. Benicia, it's about 27,000 people population, roughly, okay? Interestingly enough, the stats that have shown up in Benicia is kind of similar to Napa. You have properties that have sold below asking price, you know, in the 90 percentage of the asking price to way above asking price of like 108 to 111 percent above asking price. So that's another interesting, diverse, you know, stats in Benicia as well. I hope this is helpful. For more information, feel free to just email me at kasama at kasamasales.com about any other questions you may have about the cities that I mentioned. Last week, I talked about American Canyon, Vallejo, and Fairfield. So if you have not watched that, you'll want to stay on and watch the video. Thanks for watching.